Hello everyone, welcome back. Now let us start problem number 45, which says find the electric field at a height z above the center of a square sheet carrying a uniform surface charge sigma. Check your result for limiting cases. All right, and answer is also given. So we have problem 45. On page number 108 all right so first of all it is uh, the problem says that we have a square of surface charge uniform surface charge it means it has a surface somewhat and Sigma and we need to calculate the electric field at a distance Z from the center all right from here I think you remember the previous problems we have discussed of similar types I, uh, example 2 in the book is solved by a similar method that we have a uniform charge uh, uh, linear charge and we need to calculate the electric field perpendicular to it then we discussed in uh, problem number 4 I guess problem number 4 that we have we discussed a square there was a square and we calculated the uh, it was it also has a linear charge and lambda and we calculated the uh, electric field on, at a distance z from the center so only the difference in this question in problem 4 was that here sigma is given and here is lambda was given so in example 2 we found out that ele electric field net was net comes out to be uh, 2k lambda l upon z under root z square plus l square uh, this is for example number 2 then we further solved uh, solve, uh, for pro problem 4 and we made changes in, the, in this only the changes were that uh, z tends to z square, square plus a, a square by 4 and a l will be a square by 2 all right these changes were made in the question and we found that the net electric field was found to be i guess 4k lambda mm, a upon z square plus a square by 4 under root z square plus a square by 2 all right oh z square plus a square by 4 yes so these were found now we'll continue the same method by taking this as electric field and calculating uh, the uh, um, and changing the linear charge into surface charge so let us solve so now let us start the problem uh, we have a square let me draw it like this so that you can easily clearly see and we have a surface charge density sigma over it this is sigma all right and we need to calculate the electric field at a distance z from the center so this is a by 2 this will be z square plus a square by Four under root all right so electric field by using this formula only 4k lambda a z upon under root z square plus a square by 2 into z square plus a square by 4 all right now let us uh, make changes in this formula and as uh, you can see that this linear charge is now converted to the uh, uh, a surface charge so the value was 2 has it, it is 2 lambda and now it is converted to da so lambda is has been converted to sigma da sorry lambda, lambda has been converted to sigma da by 2 and so lambda will be replaced by sigma da by 2 all right i guess you can see it yes now putting the values e becomes e is equal to k um, 2 sigma z integration starts da and 1 a also and z square plus a square by 4 under root z square plus a square by 2 and the limits from lim limit will be from 0 to a all right for uh, because uh, this is a 
this is a all right and this is da by 2 and da by 2 the thickness is da by 2 and da by 2 so limit will be from 0 to a only all right this is because we have surface charge only in that region no? so 0 to a so let me just switch the page so we got e as k 2 sigma z limit from 0 to a a d a z square plus a square by 4 in under root z square plus a square by 2 now solving the integral is the main part here this is this integral has a direct solution all right so put a square by 4 as t so 2a da by 4 is equal to dt so a da is 2 dt e becomes uh, k 4 sigma z from 0 from 0 to uh, t and d t upon z square plus t under root z square plus 2 t and i have taken 2 in the 4 only all right so on solving further e becomes sigma z upon at uh, taking the value of k as 4 pi epsilon naught and cancelling the 4 i get pi by epsilon naught and this integral has a direct solution of uh, tan inverse uh, the, this part z square plus 2t and downside z and from limit 0 to t and uh, one in, uh, integration oh sorry 1 2 for this and 1 z all right so this is a tricky integration you can uh, take out uh, solve it separately and it will take two three pages or you can learn it directly this is very simple integration to in physics you have to learn only two or three inter special integrals that not that's not a big deal so we have sigma upon z uh, z z cancelled z z has been cancelled sigma upon pi all right and 2 also outside so i get tan inverse putting the uh, value of t inside so tan inverse under root z square plus a square by 2 upon z and minus tan inverse on putting 0 I get 1 because z square has been cancelled by this under root and z z also cancelled all right so e comes out to be let me just shift the camera yes so e comes out to be 2 sigma pi epsilon naught tan inverse mm, under root z square plus a square by 2 upon z minus pi by 4 so this will be the net electric field for a square having uh, surface charge density and we need to calculate if we need to calculate the electric field at the center uh, a height z above the center all right so this will be the electric field so he is talking that you need to check the results if a tends to infinity simple if a tends to infinity then this term uh, this term will be this only this term angle term will be tan inverse infinity and tan we all, all know that tan inverse infinity is pi by 2 pi by 2 minus pi by 4 is pi by 2 so we get 2 sigma upon pi epsilon naught into pi by 2 so we get sigma upon epsilon naught sigma upon 2 epsilon naught sorry uh, sorry pi by 2 minus pi by 4 is pi by 4 so you get sigma upon 2 epsilon naught all right if a is infinity if a tends to infinity i hope you can see it yes and if uh, z is very very greater than a then it will act as a point charge i hope it is given it is not given so one, uh, we need to apply the uh, formula here if uh, a z is very very greater than a then for point charge electric field is k q upon r square or z square all right 
so if um, z is very 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 greater than a so this term will be zero and then only uh, you we are left with only uh, these terms k q by z square so that's all for this video see you in next video